what is going on guys welcome to a new video man um what we're gonna be doing before we do get started make sure to hit the subscribe button hit that like button as well man what we're gonna be doing is swapping out the front grill here on the dodge charger 2018 uh for the 2019 uh dodge uh dodge charger grill shout out to my little man right there um the badge does not fit that uh the new grill but what we're gonna do we're gonna do some uh some uh you know some little scientific things right there i'm gonna probably gonna uh, weld or glue a, a, a screw on it and then put a ball on the other side so we can uh, actually get it to work on that um on this other grill and i'm gonna show you guys the other grill real quick and just so you guys can see i'm gonna put the link down below in the description as well we'll put that in the description all right guys so here we have man the official oem uh parts order them online through amazon make sure you guys uh check out in down below in the description will be the link if you guys want to order these same parts uh, i'm not going to do the video like we're not going to do like step by step unfortunately just way too much steps to do that and uh i, I just i, I don't want to do a step by step video i want to show you guys mainly how it looks and all that stuff so you know they come good good bubble wrap up in here and here's the grill right here with the snorkel holes right here and then the uh the snorkel come down there as well and these are the official um oem parts guys you guys did not know let me get these out of here so you guys can see them ah, here we got the little snorkel right there mopar official parts i'm going to go ahead and swap these out now what i'm talking about when I say this girl does not have uh, the thing for the badge, what we're gonna do is uh, I'm gonna show you guys in the video what we'll do to try to get that badge on there. We'll just you know we have to weld some screws on there or um, something. I noticed it did come a little dusty. Maybe it's like at a warehouse that it's a little dusty, but we're gonna get get to work. Like I said, I'm not gonna do step by step, but I will show some parts of uh, taking the other bumper off. We do gotta take the bumper off to put this new grill on, and then I'll show you guys the end result as well. But we're gonna do step by step. But let's get started. Let's see how it looks. Let's see how it ends up looking. So we're taking this grill off right now and i'm going to put the other grill on we got the bumper off um hey i see the badge right here we're going to take this badge off it comes off of the um this grill very easily what we're going to do when we went over to home depot guys and we bought a couple of things what we're going to do is uh you guys can use jb weld or um just some gorilla glue we're going to use some gorilla glue and then we're going to put uh these screws the other sides of the screws and the names we're gonna put some of these uh tubes and then also some uh some little nuts right there so you guys can see what we're gonna do is put this glue this to this to the scat uh to the scat pack logo and then like this like late let's say this is uh say this is the scat pack logo we're gonna do this put the screw on like this and then um once we put it down through the uh grill i'll show you guys once we're done um we're gonna you know we're gonna put it on here through these and then bolt it on the back and that's how we're gonna go ahead and just use the same uh the same scat pack badge we're gonna have to buy a new one and i'm gonna show you guys exactly what i mean uh as we do it all right guys so i didn't record the audio with this unfortunately but i am going to show you guys what i did so i'll put the glue on but the glue did not work. So what we had to do is do use a JB Weld, man. They sell it at AutoZone, um, Advanced Auto Parts, Home Depot, Lowe's, anywhere. You guys can go ahead and find this. You guys see the exact ones that I used. Just a regular JB Weld. And then what I did is I used those bolts that I showed you guys earlier in the video. Put them on there and just, you know, put a bunch of JB Weld on them like this so they couldn't move, man. And they're strong on there. And what we went ahead and did was put the nut and put the bolt on the back of the logo. I put the logo, you know, through the through the little holes, uh, through the little honeycomb, and then this is exactly how we bolted it. And it, this thing does not move. It is perfect. It's not gonna move, guys. And it is really on there. You guys can see that right there. I did a little test. Um, 
it's not gonna move anything like that if you guys don't know how to use jb welds go ahead and you you know use youtube it's very easy it's just like you know regular glue just a little bit stronger you don't want to get too messy all you guys want to do is go ahead and put it on a little cardboard once you guys put a little cardboard mix both of the little things that come in the package together and then you guys have your jb weld just go ahead and put it on there and that thing's not going to come off but um you know that's exactly what we did to keep this logo on there because i wanted the scat pack logo another one didn't fit that's exactly what we did and um you know, let's go ahead and show you guys the end result <laughs> guys so i couldn't get a video in the daytime but you can kind of see what it looks like there's the badge right there on the 2019 um you know grill 2019 dog charger grill i will be uh putting pictures and videos on on the screen as well so you guys can see it in the daytime you know i'm not i know that in the daytime you can't really see um you know you can't really see it i'm trying to see if i can get good angles of it but it's really hard to get good angles of it at night especially with low light but um i will be putting pictures up there and also be putting videos in the daytime so you guys can actually see the grill a little bit better we'll get a close-up of the grill you guys can see right there nice man love the look way better look than the other um grill in my opinion it's just a nice look to me but make sure you guys hit that subscribe button hit that like button let me know if you guys like the video let me know what you guys think about the grill if you like this one better the other one better i will be replacing this part right here get these um out the way so just replace that whole part i will be ordering that part soon make a video on that as well let me know what you guys think god bless and i'll catch you guys on the next one god bless <laughs>